about seven, eight people in here. Kissy bring, you know, Kissy, Kissy just brings the joy. She's like the Pied Piper of good, good vibes. She like walk the street. Who are these seven people who just walked in into our lives right here? <laughs> Kissy is back. How are you? How's your summer been? Oh, summer just started. It hasn't been yet. It's amazing. Summer. Well, you know, so you know, I, I, we 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 actually started writing this song about how endless summer. You know, and then she, yeah. Kissy came up with that, and it's actually true. Every time I, every time I see Kissy, she's always like in a good mood, and she's super summery. Even when it's like, how did that happen? You were from Sweden. That's Wait, the darkest. Wait, you blow it like, I'm goth happy. I'm not super happy. <laughs> Let's make that clear. Okay. <laughs> There's a, I'm vampire happy. So yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wh whatever you say. Thank you. Whatever you say. <laughs> <laughs> always a pleasure to have you back. Swedish people are very happy as. I guess. Right. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, we're happy to have you back, and uh, you have brand new material that you're uh, that you've been uh, kind of slowly putting out for the last six months, and uh, always a support here. A lot of the fans love love the music that and and the direction that you're going in, and uh, you're going to be performing a few songs for us today, mm -hmm. and uh, you brought a few guests, right? Well, you brought a guest. What, what, what's what's going on here? So I brought wonderful dancer Victoria Karma with me. Girl, she will be dancing with me here on the radio, and uh, we will be filming it, so you can watch it afterwards. Exactly. Yes. Yeah, and uh, tell yeah. So you have uh, let's see, you have a brand new single that just dropped, right? With a brand new EP, actually. Brand new yeah. EP. Yeah. Uh, initiation. Um, we have uh, yeah. It came out June third on our label, Kiss Kiss, and um, yeah, and a new video also for Fuse. So what's inspiring you these days to make music? What's what's the uh, what's the uh, what do you feel is the mood of a? Uh, I know you said God, you know, like you know, happy God. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, I always find that real life is a good inspiration. Um, I'm not a big fan of uh, yes. I mean, I do get stuck in my bubble, but I think. Um, I mean, music is for everyone, so I think it has to be connected somehow mm -hmm. to something that everyone can relate to. Not not everyone has to relate to every song, but I think it's important to, you know, I don't want to just, you know, sing well, about all my women when I'm on tour and like, <laughs> tour because yeah. I want to sing about real life. Yeah. Well, it, yeah, it's true, and I feel like the stuff that you're doing now kind of, because I remember the first time that you came on the show, you yeah, I knew you from the first record, which was like kind of a mellow R and B record. But then when you came on the show, you were dropping like a heavy rock and roll set of like glam rock and mm. you know a lot of. And I feel like you know, and 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 then the next time that you came here, you were playing like a lot of like really kind of avant digital sort of R and you know like I don't know like you know kind of house and techno stuff. And I kind of feel like the stuff that you're working on now is actually like kind of like a good indication of where those influences are lying and I, you know I'm, I'm just happy to hear that you kind of are able to like kind of use because that, that's the you that was a real you I was just like oh whoa where's all this rock and roll coming from right no, so this is like <laughs> so now you're like going real rock and roll yeah, yeah <laughs> in your you own know, way yeah totally but I think you have to like you have to um, um how do you you have to um, how do you say well, for a singer, for example, you have to sing really loud mm -hmm. to know how to pull back. Like, you have to try different things to know where you want to be. Like, you can't just say, I want to be here without trying and experimenting. Sure. And, and uh, you're also uh, producing most of your, your own stuff these days, right? Is yes. that what's going on? I'm producing my own stuff, and I'm also producing a couple of other uh, artists, and which is really inspiring. Uh, you used to, used to, yeah, you have the TK Wonder project, right? Oh it? yeah, we're working on TK's EP right now. Um, she's such a inspiring. Um, we known, I mean, we known each other for a minute, but we kind of just found this pocket with this um, project that is, it's, um, it's, it inspires me as an artist and a producer to just move on. Like it's, it's, and and um, I never felt that with a collaboration mm -hmm. in that way before and um, it's yeah it's, it's just like a out of body experience I wish I could like share it with you guys but as soon as I can I will be back and play Excellent. Some, yeah
And uh, who, are, who are some other artists that you're working with? Well, I'm working with Contessa Studo. Um, she's in Bushwick, Brooklyn. Um, I can't um, say her, <laughs> her name on the radio because that's a, a, a curse. <laughs> but, um, you and all this goth thing. It's like you are a witch. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm also working on Tech Plus EP. Um, and we're um, developing her sound and mm -hmm. bringing it forward. And besides, I mean, I'm also, there's so much stuff going on right now, which is so, I, I, that's the way I love it. Mm -hmm. I'm working on my album and trying to like complete that to get it out this fall. And I'm working on remixing a bunch of different artists for like a remix project that cool. I'm working on. Yeah. And we actually got, you know, I, I'm just happy because we actually got, finally got Kissy into the Devin Daryl world. So, you know, I'm excited about that as well. <laughs> <laughs> finally, finally. So, um, what are we going to do? We're going to let you uh, set up and uh, we're going to let you perform. We're excited to have you here. It's really funny because uh, I play a, a Lana Del Rey uh, Cash My Cat remix and there was a, a lot of shade that was like thrown on <laughs> online. Especially from your fans saying like, oh, she's no, you know, is this Lana? She's no kissy. <laughs> so, you know. You and your pot, you, yeah, you know, you and your rats following you around. My like a pot. Don't you dare call my fans rats, Dwayne. We'll have you right <laughs> out here. Take care of your cursing on radio. Oh, so, okay, so, yeah, right, okay. I will. Right. I'm not afraid. All right. <laughs> Maybe I just want rabies. I don't know. You know. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay, I want to apologize to all fans. No, no, no. no. Which They're not. I can, no, no, because you're a Pied Piper. You're like, but you know, who you're. Said you're that? Uh, what? You just make things up and then it's the truth. <laughs> I'm sorry. No. I'm sorry. Jesus. Oh my God. I don't even know. I need to contain myself because I'm going to perform. But if I wasn't performing, I would go ratchet right now. Oh. <laughs> I like ratchet. I like that. See, see I'm, I'm getting exactly everything I wanted. <laughs> I love you, Kissy. I love you. That was like evil. Okay. Yeah, okay. I love you, Kissy. You're going you're gonna to perform for us. I'm so, first of all, so happy you came by. I, was, I, I love when you come by. You're so much fun. You are a blast. And I'm so happy that uh, you're blessing the WFMU studios with the music. I'm excited about the directions that you're going in. It's not buttering me up enough, I don't think so. <laughs> well, we, we got two and a half hours, so okay. bear with me, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, also I want to thank Tim Wagner for stopping by from Sunrise Highway. Uh, his band is performing tonight at Glasslands with, uh, I think Tim Lovely is going to be DJing. Uh, Darshan Jusrani from Metro Area is going to be DJing. That's going to be a awesome, awesome show. But more importantly, um, Kissy is back and she's going to be performing live for us here on uh, the Dwayne Train as you coined it. <laughs> Thank you for that. So uh, we're going to play a couple more songs and then we're going to, you know, let Kissy cast a spell on you. Okay. Right. <laughs> Thanks for listening, everybody.